am alive. Don't, don't, don't go searching for me. I'm, I'm here. I'm still alive. I didn't die. Trust me. Oh, the acoustics in this room are not the best. I hope the audio is okay. <laughs> Stop it right there. What what in the heck was that framing? What tell me what that framing was that frame That's the worst frame I've ever done in my life. You can only see this. Okay, you can hardly see the dang the dang head Okay, so I'm, I apologize for that But uh, we're gonna have to live with it because uh, basically I, I'm too tired to really do much else uh, And also I, I legitimately do got to get packing so um Oh, uh, yeah, uh I don't have to deal with that. I I apologize, but uh, anyways, carry on. Welcome everybody back to the vlog. It's been a long time since I've done one of these videos, huh? Go all the way back to Las Vegas from last year at the South Point 400. That was the last time I ever did any of these vlogs. It's not that long ago, but you know what I mean. I know it's been a long time since I've done any other uploads concerning the the series and all that, but that is one of the least of my worries right now uh well it was one of the least of my worries now it is one of the things that i really want to get back into but uh given certain circumstances from the previous months of my life it is taking a turn and now um i won't be back at it until another few months but fortunately you guys are gonna have to wait on that um I apologize, but in the meantime, I will try to get out as much content as I possibly can. But, um, that's all I really have to say on that. Anyways, yes, you guys read the title right, and you guys have seen all the other pro all the other pictures I probably posted all over my other social medias, like Twitter or Instagram. But, um, yes, we are going to Fontana once again this year. Uh, the final race at the two-mile configuration at Auto Club Speedway. And conveniently and pretty poetically, the last race that Auto Club is ever going to be holding at the two-mile configuration, I will be going in from the inside and the outside. So I'll be going into the track, into the pits, into the garage, all whatnot, all that kind of stuff. And then I'll be watching from the outside of the catch fence, which hopefully will not get destroyed, but... Given whenever this vlog comes out, you, you guys will find out if it did or not. So yeah, that's basically it for the intro. Um, nothing more to really talk about. I mean, I I, I don't know if I've ever, if I've seen any of you guys there. I mean, but by the time I watch this, by the time you guys are watching this video, you probably already know. Or uh, by the time I'm editing the video, I will probably already know. But, uh, yeah, that, that there's not much left to really talk about right now. Uh, but, but, yeah, basically we're just going to wait until we get to the track. So, uh, anyway, well, might as well get packing. I mean, because, oh, wow, I hit the table real bad there. Might as well get to packing. So, I'm going to see you guys there. It is time. It is approximately... Uh, four hours until green flag racing and uh, right now we are making our way to the track going to be a fun time fun time we got our pit passes we're ready ready for this thing so let's get to the track 25 years in this Grandstands been cut off, unfortunately. Missing quite a few here tonight. Then I'll be bringing in the short track come 2025, 2026, something around there. Yeah, you like my little wall wagon up here? So at, at 10.15, it was awesome last weekend in Daytona. Finished out with 11. That was huge. <clears throat> Boys, it's the Chicago street course. Oh my lord. Oh, he's going backwards. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where is he going? Oh, he parked it in the, in the museum. That's not good. You can see the Palo Casino car up there, or you could come over here and see it right here in person. It may be a Gen 6, but boy, oh, boy, does that look clean. That looks clean as heck. Look at that. It's the Daytona 500 winner. Ricky Stenhouse Jr.'s car is ready here. 
dang this is this is a full-blown next-gen car too it's not like the uh, reddick one Woo! that's cool we got a, another another next-gen out on display with his gen 6 car dang That was a sick little display for for Logano. They even had the uh, the championship trophy set out too, but uh, it didn't look like. Yeah, couldn't really see it. Figured that I was safe not coming to the racetrack yesterday. Well, you, I think, yeah, 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 yeah you were safe. Yeah. What'd you do yet? Jimmy Johnson, the goat, the greatest of all time. He's got his own memorial. Oh boy! A lot of different seating from where we were last year, but Soon enough, those gates over there are going to open and we're going to be welcomed all the way over there up and down pit road. Ladies and gentlemen, we are in. Oh, that's cool. Oh, these are, yeah, these are Xfinity tires. Look, these are, I don't remember the name, but, uh, I don't remember the name of the team, but... That's cool. There's a lot of rims. Look at those tires. Boy, oh boy. Some cars being rolled out already. Happy Harvick. Happy Harvick. Sun is finally peeking through here at Auto Club. Didn't get to see many drivers in the pits, but that's okay. All here for the race. Won't be inside the track to see the race unfold, but we'll be in the grandstands and hopefully be staying for that good old Xfinity race. Not 100% sure on the Xfinity race, but Cup is going to be right around the corner. One more time. Now you set the goal higher, right? So then you set the bar higher and it just allows you to keep dreaming and to keep pursuing more different, you know, dreams. And that's, and that's what you want to do. You want to set the bar high no matter what sport you're in. For it. There it is. There it is in all of its glory. It's been spotted the Goodyear blimp. There it is.
Fiber Auto Club Speedway in Southern California, the NASCAR Cup Series running, the Pumpkin Casino.
Hamilton and look at the back straight away at the front of the field over Joey Logano, then Ross Chastain, Kyle Bush, first car out of the way on the bottom of the racetrack. Get the only restart I chose not to record, and this happens. You gotta be kidding me. The one restart I chose not to record.
Harvick gets pushed into the top spot. Kevin Harvick goes to second. They're side by side for third. Ross Chastain and John Logano. Joey Logano with the run in the outside lane on Ross Chastain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Position number three is the top two. We have Frank Hoy just a minute at the point. Led by Kyle Busch and Kevin Harvick. It's in turn three. Here's Harvick.
And that, my friends, concludes the weekend. Not really a weekend, but mostly just day. Uh, not able to stay for the Xfinity race, unfortunately. Because we gotta get home. And with the route that we have to take to get home, it is very, very icy. And right now is one of the only times when it's open and we don't want to take that chance to have to go the long way back again. So we are going to be heading home right now. Unfortunately, cannot stay as much as we would like to, but we'll be watching the race on our, our way home. Uh, great day today. Kyle Busch taking home the checkered flag for his first season with RCR. Chase Elliott coming in a good old second. Great day for the Elliott guys. And then Chastain, of course, coming in P3. But um, yeah, that's basically it for this vlog. I hope you guys did enjoy this. Probably have a very long vlog. I don't know. I don't know how long it's. I've been recording or how long everything is going to be put together. But hope you guys enjoyed this. I gotta go. I'll see you guys later.